All right, welcome back. Uh, it's time for us to get into some more conversations. And um, Glitz Fashion Week is coming up. George Odonko has joined us. He's the operations manager. And uh, we want to find out what they have planned, all the excitement that's happening. Uh, George, good morning. How are you? Good morning. I'm doing fine, thank you. Fantastic. Thank you for having me. Yeah. Anytime. Yeah. So talk to us. What do you have planned? <clears throat> Great yeah. Africa is always coming up with fantastic things every year. Mm -hmm. What do you have planned this year? What's happening? So this year, we're doing the 10th edition of Great Africa Fashion Week. Okay. Mm. So it's a lot. It happens to be our 10th anniversary as a company as well. Mm. So it's wow, all very big for us. Oh. Okay. Yeah. So this time around, we're actually making sure every day we have something going on during the week. Okay. So events kick-started yesterday. We had the Influencers Brunch, okay. which was a small, not so small get-together. An intimate kind of intimate thing. Intimate kind of yeah. thing with um, major influencers, okay. just so we could officially kick things starting mm -hmm. and then, you know, create excitement. Um, today, in about an hour or two, we are going to be having the Beauty Forum, okay. which is usually also a side event. It's like the foremost gathering of uh, beauty business entrepreneurs, mm. practitioners, sharing knowledge. But the key thing we've brought on board this year as part of um, the 10th anniversary is we're going to be having a business pitch for beauty businesses Okay. Um, with a panel made up of some investors and corporate personalities and our judges who are going to be, you know, vetting these people who pitch their businesses mm -hmm. for a chance to gain some substantial capital and then also three months um, exclusive mentorship with Claudia Lumo, okay. our founder and CEO at Let's mm -hmm. Africa. Right, and yeah. then what happens tomorrow? And tomorrow we have the sustainability fashion presentation. Okay. okay. Um, as part of our team this year, we're doing sustainability and creativity. Mm -hmm. So to push our agenda of sustainability, we're going to be having that show tomorrow at the New Bouquet Foundation. That's in East Legon. Yes. And f starting from around 3 p.m., should end around 6. We have a variety of designers who have inculcated sustainable measures, mm. materials, practices into their garments. So that's going to be happening tomorrow. And then, of course, on Saturday, we have the big show. That's going to be at the Grand Arena. Uh, but just before that, we have the Business of Fashion Seminar as well. And then we crown things off with two of the biggest designers in Africa, Duaba Sewa from Ghana and Atafo from Nigeria. Okay. At a private show. Well, not so private, but private, <laughs> okay. at the lot in cantonments. Right. So now you've given us a series of events happening. Who can come to which one and who can be at which one? Uh, registrations are open for almost all of them. Okay. Um, the Beauty Forum is today, but I'm sure if you still try and call ahead, you could get some last-minute tickets. Mm. Um, the Sustainable Show has tickets that are on sale as well. And the main shows are all on sale on Haptel. So you can, anybody who has a Haptel app can just quickly type in the Glitz Africa Fashion Week and you have an assortment of all the activities okay. and which ones you want okay. to sign up for. How much will we be budgeting for? Uh, anywhere between 100 cities. Mm. It's manageable. Mm. <laughs> but of cool. course, cool. great discounts. Cool. <laughs> right. now, now, so Glitz Fashion Week, you know, why is this program necessary? Uh, it's very necessary. Well, number one, Glitz mm -hmm. Africa is one of the foremost fashion events in Africa. Yeah. We are a prominent event on the calendar. And what we do is we're creating a platform that promotes fashion business, trade and export promotion. Mm -hmm. uh, usually a lot of people think it might, it's just about fashion, the fashion shows, yeah. but it's a whole business. And we like to project and promote that so that mm -hmm. people understand where the, the, the direction that the market and that industry is going from now yeah. and how it's going to go forward. Mm -hmm. So we create different avenues, platforms that help people, like the business pitch that I mentioned. Uh, usually we have a trade area where people can set up and then display their garments mm -hmm. for people who want to purchase. Mm -hmm. We have the business of fashion seminar, which is for capacity building and education mm -hmm. as well. And then, of course, we have intimate facilitations between buyers and designers. Mm. So we are creating different ways to promote the business of fashion mm. in its true commercial form. Mm. Awesome. Mm. Now let me say congratulations you know, on your 10th anniversary. Thank but you. 10 years, you know, how different will this be from the previous nine editions that we've had? I think I said this on my platform yesterday, but I'm still not going to let the secret out. Okay. We're doing a lot of activity. We're, active we're really activating the Grand Arena space on Saturday. Mm -hmm. It's going to be way different. We are owning the space. Okay. We want it to be a very, very intimate mm. experience from morning 
all the way through to late into the night okay. with different activities. So you may want to tell us a bit more about what is happening on Saturday, not the details, but what time is what starting, um, who should be there, right. if we have to buy tickets, where are we getting them from? Uh, on Saturday, it starts with the Business of Fashion Seminar, okay. uh, feature speakers like Elikem Kumoji, um, Daniel Sapon, just to mention a few. Mm -hmm. And then that is a free event. So okay. anybody who is interested in building their capacity in that space. And that is also at the Grand Arena? That's at the Grand okay. Arena from about 10 a.m. in the morning. Okay. Then we have the main shows, which starts from about 4 p.m. Mm -hmm. so over 20 designers from all over Africa and outside Africa as okay. well. Um, tickets can be gotten on Haptel, or they can simply call any of our numbers or our socials mm -hmm. to get through. What's your number? Uh, it's 050-158-1261. Uh -huh. Okay. Right. Now, um, I'm seeing the magazine on the screen, yeah, yeah, and it's bringing back quite a bit of memories. <laughs> so, I'm not sure if you know, but um, this, I'm just looking at it to see if I can see. Would you know what edition of this, of the magazine this is? Uh, which one would that be? Probably like 100 and something, or, or 200 and something edition. Okay. <laughs> it's like 10 years of producing magazines. Yeah. Well, um, I actually photographed the first, no, the second, third, fourth, I think, Covers. covers. You know, the entire magnet, the entire... The entire uh, oh, really? Oh, yeah, Not a yeah, super yeah. star photographer, yeah. you know. Oh, I have no idea. Don't do that. Don't do that. But he's a pro. He's a big friend of the brand. No, no, no. The first... The first... David said to you. Ask Claudia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The first three, four... Second... I think it was second, third, fourth. Yeah. Wow. Editions, yeah. I'm sure those might be the Sakwadi and Becker covers. No. Um, so there's um, Nasha call yeah, yeah. that, that that time. That time. So um, um, wow. Yeah. No, so you're Jocelyn pioneering Duran, the fashion yeah, media. Yeah, yeah fashion you've done amazing work. Well. You know, <laughs> I had no idea. You guys should bring the placard. Definitely. I mean, I was <laughs> telling you. Bring him. Bring him a flask. I was telling him, you know, like <laughs> or a plaque. The way he's looking, that. he's so ready for fashion week. I just told him. When he went oh to well. Well, this is David being David. No, this is David being David. You know. This is David on a normal on day. A normal oh, day. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, so um, your final thank yous. Any final words before you take leave of um, us? Definitely thank you to our partners, um, Haptel, uh -huh. uh, Ghana Free Zones Authority, our sponsor is Samsung, Center of Africa. We have support from Vena Mineral Water, um, Mac Cosmetics as well. So we're very grateful to our partners mm. for making this happen. You will say thank you to City, and next time you'll bring the proposal. I'm getting there. You, you yeah. have finished. <laughs> I'm getting there. Yeah, but he's giving the list. I'm still, I'm still getting there. No, he was done. Uh, no, you see, no I, I was waiting I for him past to this. finish. this. Oh, then I was missing right. supporters. Okay, we are waiting. Okay, yeah. so I, I take and it back. And of course, to our biggest supporters. Yeah, right. Yeah. 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 Omni Media Group. We're yeah. very grateful. Yeah. City TV, City <laughs> FM. It's been an amazing experience, and we look forward to building our relationship. Well, we, 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 we asked for it, you yeah. said it, but thank you. Okay. Uh, <laughs> All course, right, so it's happening. Course. You know, it started yesterday, the Glitz Fashion Week. Series of events happening. So if you find yourself in that space, if you want to go into that space, this is where you need to start from, you know. So I'm sure you can visit their social media handles and just get all the details you need. Some, you know, these days we don't just take anything for granted. Yeah. Regardless of whatever it is you're making, you can create sure. a business out of it. Mm -hmm. So just know what you can do, you know, the advantages of some of these um, seminars, some of these events, yeah. and just make a few bucks. You need mm -hmm. it, you know. Thank you very much, George, for your you. time Thank and you all the best. And congratulations once again to Glitz. This is Breakfast Daily. We'll be right back.